on my way guys to the port say i figured this would be a good time to um tell you guys like about my little workout routine split as a stay-at-home mama it's frozen this little thing got pockets <laughs> <laughs> Nobody understands like a mom understands what a mom understands, if that makes sense. It's progress, y'all. Progress. She had that on and she looked so like like a glazed donut and I was like, I need that. Hi guys, really quick, I just wanted to pop in here and show you something cute. I got a new package from Vooglam, and if you don't know already, you guys know that I've worked with Vooglam in the past, and they have really cute, like, stylish glasses, and their glasses are really, really cool because you can get them prescription. So you can get the frames and get your lenses prescribed per your, like, eye prescription. I don't wear glasses. I don't know the correct terms. But, yes, and they're just cute and stylish. I don't wear glasses, but they're cute for, like, um, personality glasses like accessories and all that type of stuff so I just want to share with you guys my new box so I got like a couple pairs so this is what they come in they actually come in their own little bag this is very soft material so it's great for the lens um, oh my gosh stop can you not these are so cute I've really been into like green lately like over the past year I just love green I think it's so cute but look how cute these are let's see okay and they're tinted being on the screen in front of a camera laptop tv your phone all of that has blue lights and so these are blue light blocking which will protect your eyes they come with little eye cleaners which is so nice and i can't think of my code right now but i am gonna have a code but whatever it's gonna be on the screen and down below in the description box so now onto the try on part my favorite part so these are the first pair these are so cute. Like, I love the thin rim up top. But then, like, here's the regular. Here's how they look from the side. This is giving, like, oh, like, I have to go get my nails done today. Like, let's go get our nails done and put on our cute glasses. I love these. They're, like, a olive green color. And the lens, it's not totally clear. It's, like, a yellowish vibe. I love these. These are probably my top so far. I mean, it's the only one I've seen so far. And I forgot which ones I picked out, so this is really fun. Okay. These next pair are cute. They're like a muted, like, grayish purple, but pulling more gray. Um, with the tortoise on the sides. Like that. Okay, these are cute. I like these. These are cute for, like, everyday or like when I'm like working at the computer or yeah. Here's how they look from the side. They're definitely a statement and like they hug the nose like just enough. They sit right under the brows and far from the face also, as you can see. But these are cute. I like these, you can dig these. I got all of the frames um, with their advanced protection. So, Blue light blocking and the advance. Ooh, I'm gonna like these. I think y'all are gonna like these too. These are just like your classic, like every person needs these in the collection. Like, super cute. Okay, these are really cute. I love these. These are like, probably like my favorite, like stylish ones, but like these, they're stylish yet like practical. Like you need a pair of black personality glasses. These are really cute if you do get your, um. If you do get your frames prescribed, I see Kai in the background. <laughs> but here's how they look. Just simple, all black, like it's giving sophisticated, like we love that. Here's how they look from the side. I, this side, oh, no, I like these a lot. These are cute. This is definitely like fitting today's vibe actually. Wow, I love these. These are like fun. Hmm. Okay. I'm not really like a cat eye type of person, but like the way these sit, because they sit so beneath the brows, like we can dig it. 
I don't like that, but I like that. It's like, I like that a lot. They're fun. It's a really cute um, color combo for the spring and summer coming up. So they're like all pink on the sides and it's more of a fuchsia color. Being like night out in the town stripes. <laughs> I don't know how I was going to feel about these when I saw them online, but like, it's not bad. Even closer. I actually like the color combo. It's like fun. And the last pair I got, oh, these are cute. It's giving like a hologram. Cute. Is it a butterfly? It's giving butterfly. Clear, but it's like holographic. So they're like just a little, little fun. And like depending on like how you turn your face or your angle. But I like the size of them. This is cute. This is fun. These frames are really, really cute. Like for dressing up, um, like a costume or something. Or like your everyday like Fun, but these are like another great option I feel like if you wear prescription and you want like a little some fun ones like if you're a teacher I feel like this would be fun kind of like off so they got a little funky with it a little play on the frames and the way these hug your nose is just so comfy I'm gonna put these on again cuz like I love these so much I love the color like these are so cute and I think I like them a lot because like this frame part is so low or sorry so much thinner than this but like, so cute. And I love gold. They will match my accessories like perfectly. So make sure you guys let me know your favorite frames down below. And again, if you like any of these in particular, I'm gonna have them all linked down in the description box. And again, you can use this code to save for your own pair for yourself. Um, and I believe it's free shipping worldwide also. I'm pretty sure. But they're always having discounts, always having sales. So make sure you check them out. Thank you so much to Vuglam for working with me on this portion of today's video. You guys know I love you. And one more thing, I do want to say like every glasses order also comes with like an eye ruler. So you know how everyone has like that drawer that just has like random things in there. And say your friend is like, oh my gosh, like I love your glasses. Where did you get them? Oh, they don't really fit my face. Or I wonder, pull out the measuring, pull out the eye measure and measure your eyes. Yes, I actually love these. I might keep these on for today. Like, these are so cute. I love them so much. Here's another look. Now I'm back to the vloggy vlog. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, we are going to... My lips are so dry, I can't even talk. I know it's super bright but so if you've been here since the beginning then you know that like um you know that makeup is like my first love on my channel so I was like you know what I haven't shown them any like makeup content in a minute so I figured I'd include that in today's vlog and my name is Kayla by the way nice to meet you if you're new I am a lifestyle content creator with a focus on like motherhood, beauty, and fashion. And lately I've been in my fitness bag. So yeah, you get a little bit of everything over here. Now I just washed my face. I'm getting ready for, um, I'm going to a Galentine's. Today is February 4th and I got invited to like a Galentine's day party. Isn't that so cute? That's so like mom. And I was just thinking like, I love having and like meeting new mom friends because like if you're not a mom or if you are a mom then you know that like having someone who like understands you so well when it comes to like being a mom is like top tier because of course you have your dad as and like you know but like nobody understands like a mom understands what a mom understands if that makes sense but um so I'm excited and um, where I'm going is near my mom's house. And so Kai, my mom's gonna keep Kai while I'm at the party and yeah. So, and I am gonna vlog there. I was on the phone with my mom yesterday. She was like, did you ask her if it's okay to vlog? I'm like, you right, let me ask. Cause you know, not everybody is like into that. But she was like, girl, I don't care. No, but she was saying she doesn't mind at all. So, yeah. And follow me on TikTok, guys, because I'm on TikTok. TikTok and Instagram, like, follow me on there because if I'm not posting on YouTube, I'm posting on there. <coughs> There's this random mini water, so 
let's do that but yeah this face is so dry but what i was trying to say is if you follow me on tiktok then you know that like i like to do my eyebrows before i do my skincare because i like doing my eyebrows with um sorry i like doing my eyebrows with a dry face because it gives me more control by the way i'm gonna have everything linked down below in the order that i'm using it so and i have to leave in like two hours and i still have to get kai ready and stuff so let's just move along so if you want to know what i'm using and everything just check down below in um the description box but i also want to say i went to solid core this morning and it was so good such a good workout so lately i figured this would be a good time to um tell you guys like about my little workout routine split as a stay-at-home mama so what i find that works best for me is starting out on my fitness journey and i'm pretty sure you as well like if you are or if you can relate like ideally is like at least five times a week right so monday through friday weekends off However, I find what works best for me is, especially as a mom, like, you just got to get it in when you can. And it's so hard to, like, keep consistent when, or it's hard to stay consistent when, like, you're starting out because it's so easy to find an excuse to not do it. And you don't have that, like, you know what I mean? Like, maybe the first week or so, you're like, okay. But by the second week, it's like, okay. But what I find is best, instead of going, like, five days consecutively in a row, I've still been going five times a week, but I've been doing like two days on, one day rest day. So that way, because if I go two days, such as the weekend, say if I were to go Saturday and Sunday, not work out Saturday and Sunday, by the time Monday comes, it's so hard to get back into that. And like, I feel like one rest day in between the two back to back days, like that's just, it's just perfect. And I find that's what's been like working for me. So I'm so excited that I found my like little thing. Of course, things come up like yesterday, for instance, if you saw in the last vlog, like um, I wasn't, um, I went to get my hair done and I was like working and everything. It just, it was hard for me to like, I couldn't make it to the gym yesterday because life happens. And so that was two days in a row that I didn't go because I didn't, um, I worked out Monday and Tuesday, but I didn't work out Wednesday and I didn't work out no, no, no. I worked out Sunday, worked out Monday, didn't work out Tuesday. I don't know what I'm trying to say is I had two days in a row where I had a rest day, two days in a row. And this morning when I went to solid core on my way, I was like, oh, this is hard to like get pumped up for my workout. I don't know. But try that is what I'm trying to say. And let me know how that works for you. I got my nails done as you guys saw also. I'm just like feeling good. Oh. not that I wasn't feeling good without my nails it's just nice to have my nails done like if I want to get my nails done it feels nice to be able to do that I'm sorry if you can't really see me but I am sitting directly in front of the sun but this is but I feel like it's better to have this lighting opposed to like not so if I look washed out I'm sorry anywho I got some new goodies from Sephora that I wanted to try out so I have this I'm actually going to use this today this is the benefit about Mm. the benefit bad gal bang mascara i've actually used this before i got the mini but i've actually used it before um it's just that i've been using Too Faced born this way and it's getting like i like to use my mascara for like until it's literally like nothing coming out but and my current one is currently at that right now so i got the fenty beauty hydrating primer which i'm gonna use this today too i got the super goop glow screen um, in golden hour I went to cycle bar my first class ever and this girl the front desk associate associate she had that on and she looked so like like a glazed donut and I was like I need that this is the Charlotte Tilbury airbrush brightening flawless finish um, and I got the one size oh I'm gonna try this today the one size ultimate setting powder I kind of want to film a TikTok though I might film a TikTok with all the new products. Um, Makeup on Mario Foundation. Um, so the Kosas Concealer, we're going to have to talk about this because yesterday 
And I got the mini because I wanted to try it out because I saw a lot of people using it. But then apparently it's like it can grow molds and like it's been breaking people out. Hives. And when it comes to my face, listen. So I just, I'm very like, you know, I guess it's a good thing that I saw that stuff on TikTok because I'm not using it now because I'm not even going to like, you know, do that. But anyway, I got this Paula's Choice Exfoliate. Um skin perfecting bha liquid exfoliant is a lot but i'm sorry i'm kind of rushing right now it's gonna be down below but this is the fancy hydrating primer and yeah love this stuff the galentine's so it's so cute it's themed too obviously valentine's day but she says to wear like pink or red and so i got this like pink um juicy couture style like it's from fashion over though but like the velour like tracksuit or whatever i got one of those and it's like hot pink <laughs> yeah so that's what i'm wearing and i'll probably wear like my platform like chucks and yeah i wish i had a cute like black puffer i don't have one of those but it's okay okay so let's get into the face love this foundation I'm like really into um the Mary Phillips and that whole like makeup trend on TikTok. The Kylie Jenner, no. Kendall Jenner, Hailey Bieber. I think I talked to you guys about it in the last vlog. I don't know. But um I do like it. But like I like putting my foundation first. And I'm just I'm just gonna do that. I've really been like craving like that 2016 like full coverage like beat lately with the bright under eye like natural makeup has been in and I think it'll always be in because it always just looks good but like there's nothing wrong with full beat I was playing in makeup and if you guys saw my postpartum hair loss video I did my face that day just you know trying out different like techniques and stuff because for a while I got like bored with makeup but recently i've just been like inspired again like literally watching tutorials and just like i love a good face base you know this is the sonia kashik um beauty sponge boo is he okay hurt kai like coughing but then he went silent so i'm like is he choking he's fine and the tv's so loud so kwan couldn't hear me so something that i learned on tiktok <laughs> is um they say like when you're blending out your concealer start at the edges down here instead of like up here so like it's, you see how it's like separate like a clear like line S diffuse out that line before going up front Whereas I would start up here and then I would be like, oh, it kind of like takes away some of the concealer. And it's like, no, it's because you're putting the whole sponge back on there and it's like soaking it all up. And yeah, it's just taken away from the opaqueness. That way there's not much you have to blend, which is why you let your concealer sit, you know. I hope that made sense. And also don't put it like directly under your eyelid. I think I did that today, but try not to <laughs> it is hot sitting in front of this sun where are you guys watching from like where you guys live where are you guys there's this car that like has been parking in my spot all week and i i live on a i live in the city so like there's like parallel parking in the neighborhood and like where i park is like directly in front of my home and so and i fought hard to get this spot because I moved from Maryland to DC and so um DC has strict like residence laws where like you have to um have DC parking to park like during the weekday in the neighborhood you have to have DC tags and for a while I didn't and I finally got it and it's like I would have to like I would get tickets and stuff and like um so like I would have to park in the back, but the back is like just, it's chaotic parking back there. Cause it's like a fence, it's just like a lot. 
And so um, I was like, no, I'm parking in the front. And it's just easier, like, with the baby and the car seat and stuff. And this car has been in my spot. Mind you, I'm still in front of my house, but, like, this car is, like, directly in front. And it's like, excuse you for the past week. And I don't appreciate it. So also on TikTok, what I've learned is before you go in with, like, your loose setting powder, like your baking powder, you want to set the face. And I was never a fan of baking because I'm like, this is just going to, like, this just doesn't look good. Like, it just looks splotchy. But here's where I was going wrong. You have to set the makeup first with a setting, like, you know, set your face with the setting powder before baking. So I don't have, like, a setting powder. That's, like, my shade or, like, what I want to do. What is this? This is not what I'm looking for. I'm going to set it with this pressed powder. This is by... LYS Beauty, List Beauty, is their triple fix translucent powder and Brilliance Banana. It's like a yellow setting powder. And then I also have like this MAC Medium Deep Skin Finish. Um, so I've been mixing both of these and setting my under eye because I don't want it like super yellow. And I'm gonna go in and brighten with the baking powder. You wanna make sure your creases are out. Wait, I'm not done concealer. Hold on. I think I did this last time. So I go in with my normal concealer, but then I go in with an even brighter one right in the, like right here. And I don't really let this one like sit too far, sit too long. It's just like, makes it so much brighter. Like I told you guys, I'm into the bright under eye. For a minute, I was like, eh. But I'm like, I want that. That looks so good. Remember, like, paint pots from MAC? And then people were like, oh, you can just do the same with concealer. And not too shabby. Nice. This little powder puff is on my Amazon storefront. Wait, did I want to bake with this? I didn't want to use a brush. Oh, no, it's still there. What um, time is it done again? Three. Three? What time you need? I want to leave by two. What time you need on your makeup? Boo, I can't tell you a time, but I mean, not that much longer. But like I was saying, this powder puff, I wasn't understanding the hype over this, but now I get, like, if you do it correctly. So while I look a little fright, fright, I'm going to do my eyes. I saw this trick. You like take a card or something with an edge like this. Take your shadow. Boom. It's a little smoky shadow. I try not to think too much when it comes to it because then I'd be here all say, honey. Cute. And honestly, like, I love lash extensions. They're so pretty. But I just can't have thin natural lashes like i just can't stand that they thin out my natural lashes and i don't like sit there and like pull them out like they just because i'm the type of person like i'll i would walk around with three extensions on until they came off by themselves like so this lipstick is by the lex factory and she's my she's my friend i met her on instagram actually <laughs> And I'll link her Instagram down below. I'm not sure if she's still selling these or what, but check her out. This is in the shade Vanilla Latte. And the formula is so nice. And on top of this, I'm going to put clear gloss just to give it some more like... We're done, guys. I just have to... Get Kai together, and I'll see you guys when we're all dressed. On our way to Nani's. I'll see you guys when we get there. Just got to my mom's house. Kai's already inside. Hey. Huh? Hey. It's my birthday, baby. <laughs> 
It's called You look cute. Yeah, it is. Thank you. Hi, guys. <laughs> you are cold. Hey, Bill, because all that stuff is good. Hi, baby. Hi, hey, big boy. This little thing got pockets. You got pockets, buddy. Hey, buddy. Hey, the buddy. Handsome. Hi. He has high hair, but I have his brush. Mom, I need you to take a picture. I don't know if I have a picture of him in his outfit. Okay. You look cute. Cold out there? Yeah, it is. He loves that elephant. Oh, he does? With the boob. You're not on there. Um. Oh. <laughs> on my way, guys, to the port, say. Let's turn Pastor Mike Jr. down. I gotta get the address. She lives like five minutes from my mom. Seven minutes. Okay. Alrighty, guys. I'll see you there. So cute. Okay. Hey. And I'm like, I'm just. Wait, let me see how I look. You look cute. I eat this Take it away, feeling too good to me Chilling all day, all in your space is where I want to be Here in this room, what did you do? It's progress, y'all. Progress. Okay, okay, okay. Can't go crying. I dropped my brush. Okay. 
How we look it? I'm gonna show y'all the original picture. Mara, you still looking for one? Yes, I I'm bad. Those ones, huh? Love that. Just give it pretty candy hearts. That's what you should call it, candy hearts. So cute. The blueberry um, by Stella. No, it's really good. It's really good. Is that the blueberry one? No, it's really good. I have that at Christmas. Is it good? I'm like, it's really good. apply my lips. Oh, we're going viral. Like, can you got it? It's frozen. What? I can't. Oh, 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 o